Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. In today's video, I'll walk you through how to create a taxonomy for the employee center in ServiceNow, a super helpful way to organize your content and improve the user experience. Let's discuss a use case. Why create a taxonomy? Let's say your organization offers various knowledge articles, catalog items, and quick links to employees. Without a proper structure, it can get pretty hard for users to find the right content. That's where a taxonomy comes in. It lets you group related content under clear topics and subtopics, making navigation inside the employee center much more intuitive. Let's start by navigating to content taxonomy. Under that, click on taxonomies. Click on new to create our own one and name as my company taxonomy and save that. Once that's created, if you scroll down, you can see the child topics related list. In that, click on new and let me name it as main topic. And save that. Now still under the main topic, you have child topics. Under that, click on new. This time, name the topic as topic 1 and save it. We can now connect any content in the connected content. For that click on new and in the content type let me add a catalog item. Catalog item be acrobat and submit it. I have created another topic called topic 2. This time feel free to connect a different type of content. It may be a catalog item, knowledge article or even a quick link. In the topic 2 in the connected content, I have mentioned knowledge article. Once you have set up your taxonomy and topics, let's bring it into the R employee center. For that, navigate to portals. Under that, click on employee center and change the scope to employee center core. And let's add our taxonomy to the employee center. For that, click on edit. And we have two active taxonomies. We want my company taxonomy. So I am switching it to the slash packet and save it. Now let's see whether a taxonomy is getting displayed over in the employee center. We can't see any. To check that, Go to advanced portal navigation and click on this icon open record change the scope again to employee center click on sync hierarchy to get all our taxonomy items you can see our taxonomy menu item main topic to get displayed let me make it to true. Similarly, similarly these two. And if you go back to employee center and refresh the page, you can see our taxonomy like topic one and topic two. In the topic one, I have mentioned the catalog item Acrobat. And in the topic 2, I have mentioned a knowledge article. You can see. That's it. You have created a structured taxonomy for your employee center. It's a great way to streamline access to important content for your users. If you found this helpful, make sure to like, subscribe and leave a comment if you have any questions or feedback. I would like to hear from you. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.